Hello, welcome back to my channel. And today I decided that we are going to look at some coins and stuff and we're gonna make some coin sounds. Hopefully you will enjoy them and they will make you feel relaxed and stuff. So here we go. I'm just randomly gonna pick one coin and then we're gonna talk about it. The first coin that I'm going to pick right now is this this 20 pesa coin. I don't know if the camera can focus. There we go. So this is a 20 pesa coin. For those who don't know, the currency of India is rupees and the denomination is done in pesi. For example, how the currency of America is dollars and the denomination is done in cents. Similarly, so this is a 20 pesa coin. You can see 20 and you can see C P A I S. The E has kind of like washed off or something. And if you can carefully look, it says it says right here, I think 1987. That's when this coin was made. And I got these circular patterns and stuff and on the back you can see the in the back you can see the the national emblem of India which is the the three lines of Ashoka in here it shows the term India written in here it shows the term India written in English and here in Hindi you can see the term Bharat being written Bharat of course meaning India and yeah if you see how many sides this thing has one two three four five six so this coin has like six sides to it so that's kind of interesting and this is the 20 pesa coin now let me pick another one out of random now we're going to take a look at the 25 pesa coin and um, let's see how do you find this particular one I happen to have actually two 25 pesa coin and uh, first we're going to take a look at this one it says I, I don't know it's kind of hard to tell I think it says 1975 down there if you if you see I think that's supposed to be 7 1975 and you can see these design I don't know the exact meaning behind this design but um, this is something that is very very common to be noticed in these kind of coins at the back you can notice the Ashoka emblem and like, like the previous coin this has the term India written in English and Bharat written in Hindi. This one is very, very old. This makes the coin, I don't know, 85, 95, 2005, 2015. This is almost a 45 year old coin. Wow, no wonder it's so dark and muddy. The next coin that I have, it's also a 25 pesa coin. But when was this made? 1986. So back in the old days, pesa coins were actually very, very common. Now they, nowadays, nobody values them. And it, it's kind of similar like the previous coin. This one is 1986 and. Nineteen 
1975 and 1986 and then you turn both of these on their back um, let me just put it like this and they're more or less same I, I think they're more or less same this slight little pattern um, at the side working as a border so that makes it pretty cool isn't it anyway so let's keep this aside as well now i have a 10 pesa coin and this was from back in 1986 as you can see in english you can see the word p a i s e which means This coin has a very unusual design to it. And again, the national emblem of India, the three lions, and India written in English, and Bharat word written in Hindi. This one is kind of smudged, yeah, smudged. Um, I, and, and, you know, below the, below the emblems on all of these coins, I think they're written they have written Satyamev Jayate. For those who don't know, it means the truth will prevail. That's what Satyamev Jayate means. So, now uh, let me just pick up one more coin. And what coin shall I pick right now? Let's pick a 5 rupee coin. This is. A five rupees coin. You could see the five and the term rupees. And this one was made back in the year 2000, which is almost 20 years ago now. So, it's it's so weird because when you hear the term 2000, some people may think it's not that far away, but 20 years is a long time. That's crazy. And you could see these little floral patterns at the side of the five up in the Hindi it says rupee and there's a u there's a very nice border around the coin this is a pretty thick coin actually it looks like it's made by merging two different coins into one I don't know why so but yeah just the design again the back of these coins are going to be pretty much same the national emblem of India and the term India and Bharat and Below the national emblem, it says Satyamev Jayate, which, as I recently told you, means the truth will prevail. I should probably keep all these coins together that I've shown you. Let's see what kind of noise these coin makes. Hopefully that was not too violent for you. <laughs> anyway, let's keep this aside and I'm gonna take uh, we're gonna go come back to the 10 pesa coin I believe because I have a few variations of that too. This is a 10 pesa coin if you can't tell. It says one zero. At the side it says the term see how can I see it like that P A I S E here it says Pesi in Hindi and this was made back in let's see can you see it the year 19 1972 I believe I don't know the way they wrote 7 back in the day was so weird man I think, yeah, this is back in 1972, so how old is this? This is also a pretty damn old um, coin. Um, 48? 
if we are 48 years old. Damn. Not 48, wait a minute, no, not 48. 82, 92, 2002, 2012. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 47, 47, sorry, not 48. Next year it's going to be 48. Right now it is 4, 7, As usual, the Ashoka, the, the lines of Ashoka, but there's some pretty cool little design that's going around. I think it is also floral pattern and I really like the design. It is a pretty cool design in my opinion, what do you say? Comment down below. Oh mama, that's so cool. And how many freaking sides this thing got? It's got ridges, one. a slightly modern coin and this is going to be well it's not exactly modern this is a 20 year old one rupee coin holy moly and as you can see that in the middle there is one the digit below one is a rupee below rupee is 1999 and above one it says rupiah which is hindi for rupee and at the side of one, there are corns. I don't know what corns has to do with anything, but I guess they do make it look kind of cool and stuff. I guess it has something to do with the former revolution that India went through back in the day, but whatever. Right now I can't remember much about the Indian history. I don't know why, even though I'm studying history. Yet again, like I said, nothing too surprising. The Ashoka Lion, India, Bharat, and Satyamayva Jayati, Satyamayva Jayati, Satyamayva Jayati. The truth may prevail, the truth may prevail, the truth may prevail. Let's keep it at the side too. This is a two to be coin. Now there's something new. It says two. On top of it, now you see, before and all the other coins, the 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 lions were at the back. Now in this one, it's in the front, which is something unique, and we always appreciate unique things. At the side, it says India rupees, and here it says Bharat rupee. So, let's see what is at the back of this unique ass looking coin. We turn the coin and, oh my god. It says, Rash, it says, Rashtriya Ekta, National Integration. This was made back in the year 1998, which makes this, I believe, 21 year old coin. How amazing is that? And here is a beautiful, amazingly detailed rendition of the map of India. The map of India. The map of India. Who doesn't like? 
Suddenly my IQ level has dropped down by minus 100, but this looks such a beautiful coin, showing the map of India, 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 Bharat, Kanaksha, Naksha, Naksha, okay bro, moving on, we have This is a fairly modern coin actually, made in the year 2012, which makes it a 7-year-old coin. And now if you see, by that time, India got its own unique symbol for rupee, the Ra, the Ra, the Ra, this is called the Ra, Ra stands for rupees this makes it two rupees at the side of the two rupee coin we have we have uh, the floral patterns the floral patterns at the back it's it just goes generic ashoka lion We have another 2 rupee coin, wow, the number 2 has suddenly become very very popular. Again, you see that word 2, Indian rupee, Bharatiya rupee, and above the 2 there is the Ashoka line telling us Satyam Evajayate, which means that the The two rupee coin. Oh, now we have a family. You can see the papa, the mama, child number one with balloons and child number two with nothing. Made back in 1993. Oh boy, that's pretty cool, isn't it? And it says in Hindi. Chota Parivar Hush Chota Parivar Hushia Apar 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 What does this mean? Well they tell you that in English it means small family happy family small don't understand. I don't know why the population is still increasing when they literally have a coin telling you that small families are happy family back in, you know, way back. How old is this freaking coin now? 27 years ago. I don't know. This old ass coin is telling us small family, happy family and we still cannot get it. Anyway, last but not the least, I decided to end this at a higher note and where we got a 10 rupee coin this is the most expensive coin you can get right now in India and it has the most unique my favorite design there's the silver surrounded by a golden colored 
metal or whatever and you see they conjoin they're joined huh the tin is half silver half gold and it got these bunch of cool looking lines which means that this is a legit coin of course the back is amazing too unique it has the Ashoka Lions Sing India at one point and Bharat at the other point made back in 2014 which makes it exactly five years old coin bro that is amazing isn't it yeah so these are all the coins that I had to show you and I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, then consider subscribing to the channel and liking the video. And if you have a suggestion,